Now let us discuss about dynamic blocks. Uh, whenever you have a requirement of creating multiple uh, blocks, for example, security group ingress rules, NACL rules, and uh, um, and load balancer rules, you need to create the block for multiple times. For example, in our last uh, session, we have ingress rule opened 22. But what uh, but generally we need to open port number 80 and 443 for HTTPS. We need to repeat this block for uh, multiple times. Instead of repeating multiple times, we can generate this block dynamically at runtime. So that is through dynamic block. You can just check the syntax. The syntax is dynamic and which block you are repeating and you should have one iterator and here the content will goes. Now let us apply this here for the security group and then let us see. Let me copy this security group. Okay, here allow SSH HTTP HTTPS this is the name. And HTTP, HTTPS, VPC ID. And this block needs to be dynamically created for multiple times. The syntax is dynamic. Ingress. You need to store those values at some, some point. Either you can store it in variables or locals. Here I am giving ingress rules. This should be a list of map. Okay, here description is going to be changed. Port number is going to be changed. Protocol is mostly TCP and this IP address is same. So these three parameters are going to be changed. Mostly from port and to port are same. I need to have description, description equal to SSH from my system, port number equal to 22. And similarly for port number 80, this is HTTP and port number 443. Okay, now we need to iterate this through for each block for each equal to local dot ingress rules. And content, this is the content going to be created multiple times. Okay. Now here the syntax is this one. Ingress dot value dot. What is the key name description? Same here ingress dot value dot port. This port is also same. Okay, we need the IP address. So we have that data source already written. Okay, so this is how we create dynamic blocks. Now let us see. Terraform plan. Now you see we got three blocks. One is 80, 443, and then 22. Now let us apply and then see. Let's verify in the console. 
go to security groups we have the security group created and if you see the inbound rules we have https we have http and then we have ssh from my system so like this you can generate any number of uh, any number of blocks up to 10 20 usually in mac as we have multiple entries and in security groups we have multiple entries you can use this dynamic block